Here at Thrive Themes, we know that one of the most valuable assets for any online business is its email list. And that's why we built Thrive Leads to be the most powerful and versatile lead generation tool for WordPress. So in this video, I am gonna walk you through the top 10 reasons why you should be using Thrive Leads to help build your email list and convert visitors into subscribers, customers, and true fans. Are you ready for this? Let's go. Hi, I'm Matt from Thrive Themes. No matter what lead generation solution you're currently using, in this video, I'm gonna walk you through the top 10 reasons why Thrive Leads is the very best WordPress tool when it comes to growing your email list faster. So let's get started with reason number one. Every opt-in form type imaginable is at your fingertips inside Thrive Leads. For example, we have the pop-up light box the sticky ribbon, which will show a banner at the top or bottom of your screen and will stick to that area as the visitor scrolls down the page. We also have the slide-in box like you see here and you can program it to appear in any corner of your page and will stay there as the visitor scrolls down. And also we have a few templates where if the visitor clicks the close button, the slide in box will minify so it'll stay on the page as the visitor scrolls. Next we have the screen filler light box like you see here and it is very similar to the pop-up light box except it takes up the whole screen which is really nice to eliminate distractions of your content from the conversion focus of the visitor signing up. And similar to the screen filler light box, we have the scroll mat like you see here, which also takes up the full screen, but will close when the visitor scrolls down the page. And finally, we have a few opt-in form types that are specific to blog posts and sidebars. The first of which being the widget form type like you see here, which you can program on any of your sidebars on your website, especially if you're using Thrive Theme Builder. And then we also have what's called the inline form that you see here, which you can program to appear within your blog content. And finally, we have the post footer opt-in form type like you see here. And like the name suggests, it appears at the bottom of your blog content. And not only do we have all of these different opt-in form types, but we have dozens of conversion focused, professionally designed templates for each one. And within those templates, we have several different opt-in form strategies like this yes, no opt-in form template like you see here, where clicking yes will bring the visitor to a sign-up state and clicking no will close the light box. We also have some multiple choice and multi-step opt-in form templates. So say you have more than one opt-in offer, you can present them on a single opt-in form and then set up the buttons where a specific sign up state is shown and then you can have that specific offer be sent after the conversion happens. Of course with Thrive Leads you do have the freedom to build your forms from scratch if you want to using the blank template. However, for the sake of rapid implementation, we always recommend that you look through our dozens of gorgeous templates, find one that matches your needs best, and then customize it to start collecting those emails as fast as possible. Which brings us to reason number two. Customizing your opt-in forms in Thrive Leads is click to edit easy. For example, you can customize any element on your Thrive Leads opt-in forms. So you can inline edit the text, you can change button colors or background colors in just a few clicks. And you can even replace demo content like these images in just a few clicks as well. And before you know it, you have a completely customized opt-in form to give away your specific offer and grow your email list. And this brings me to reason number three. The advanced lead generation element inside Thrive Leads allows you to collect not just your standard name and email data, but tags, custom fields, and hidden field data as well. So in this example, you can see I took that same template and made a few advanced modifications, not just in the design, but also added an advanced custom field radio button feature to it where I can present multiple options to visitors and have them select one and collect some lead segmentation data to help in my email marketing. For example, setting up specific automations based on what the visitor selected. 
If you're curious to learn more about how to set up things like radio buttons on your Thrive Leads opt-in forms, check out this video I published all about that and it will walk you through how to build a form like this in just a few minutes. All right, so let's move on to reason number four. Thrive Leads opt-in form templates are mobile responsive straight out of the box. That means no matter what screen size your opt-in forms gets displayed on, they're gonna look great on desktop, tablet, and mobile too. And these mobile template designs do not hem you in. With the Thrive Leads editor, you just click on the mobile or tablet version of the form, and then you can make specific edits and customizations to the form that you need to make it look perfect on those smaller screen sizes. For example, if you like how an image looks on the desktop version but not on the mobile version, it's really easy to hide that element or rearrange it in a way that looks better. Let's move on to reason number five. Thrive Lead Smart Links can help you turn your lead gen funnels into sales funnels. Let me show you what I mean. If you remember our inline content form from earlier, it's a two-step form, which means the first step it has a button and the second step opens up a sign-in state. Well, I customized this form to also have what we call an already subscribed state. And this is where the smart links come in. If you set up an already subscribed state, you can create a smart link and send it to your current subscribers via email. And if they click on that link, when they come to your website, the already subscribed state will show for them. And that doesn't have to be another opt-in offer or ask to have someone sign up to your email list again. Instead, you could do something clever like show them a product offer, say for your online course, which is what I've done here. So if we go to the Thrive Leads dashboard and click on advanced features, you see this smart links option. From here, we can set up that smart link I was talking about. So step one, we'll say we want to send it to a blog post because we're talking about this inline form that is on a blog post. And we'll find the post. I just have it titled Lorem Ipsum Post. And then I, for this particular case, I want it to only target a particular lead group, that inline form. From there, I'll click on the inline post footer and widget examples. That's just the name of my lead group I, I titled it. And I want it to display the already subscribed state and show for as long as possible. I have all those settings created. I copy the link it generates. And then if a subscriber clicks on that link and loads my blog post page, you'll see that that already subscribed state shows and then so it's promoting a, an online course offer and they click on the button and I've set it up to take a visitor to my online course sales page. This is a great benefit to Thrive Leads users because as your online business matures and you get more proficient with the tool, you can use it not only to help grow your email list but convert current subscribers into customers too. And this brings us to reason number six. Thrive Leads gives you the ability to set up advanced display and targeting settings. So if you come into the Thrive Leads dashboard and for a given lead group like this light box example, click on the display settings icon, the display settings light box opens. And this is where you will tell Thrive Leads where to show and where not to show a given opt-in form. So you have the option to display across your entire website or be very targeted about where certain opt-in forms appear. Like you can have it show on all of your pages or all of your posts, or maybe you wanna show it on all of your blog posts, posts like you see here, but then exclude it from a, a given post that is totally possible and really opens up infinite options for you in terms of how your opt-in forms display. Which brings us to reason number seven. You can have your opt-in forms behave exactly how you want them to with our advanced trigger settings. So to show you what I mean, I have this pop-up light box example here, and we have trigger settings that I can click on. And here, if I click on this drop-down box, you can see a number of trigger settings available, especially for a light box, where you can have it show directly on page load after a certain number of seconds has passed, after a certain percentage of a page has been scrolled down or a certain element has been reached by a visitor, and even what we call exit intent, which is where a visitor on desktop will move their cursor to the edge of the browser and then the 
the light box will appear. And because mobile devices don't use cursors, we offer something called Smart Exit, where the light box will appear after a given number of seconds for the mobile device when you have Smart Exit enabled for desktop. And when it comes to opt-in form behavior, the frequency at which a visitor will see your opt-in forms can also be set with this display frequency option. And this frequency setting gives you the power to tell Thrive Leads how often you want the same visitor to see a given opt-in form. Let's move on to reason number eight. Thrive Leads has advanced yet simple to use opt-in form A-B testing. Now there are several different types of opt-in form A-B tests you can do, and I just wanna run you through a few of them right now. The first is what I like to call a design A-B test. So let's say we have two opt-in form types that look very much the same, yet there's one variable you've changed that you wanna test, like the headline. That's very easy to set up in Thrive Leads, because we can come into the Thrive Leads dashboard and clone a given opt-in form, like you see here, enter the edit design or the Thrive Leads editor for that cloned opt-in form, and then very quickly change the headline if that was the one variable you wanted to test. Thrive Leads also gives you the power to test different opt-in form types against each other. For example, a pop-up light box versus a sticky ribbon. And the way you would do that is come into a given lead group, set up two different forms, like a light box form and a ribbon form, then click on this test types of form against each other button. And then here you can title the test, record your A-B test hypothesis in the notes here, and then select the opt-in form types you want to test against each other. In this case, the ribbon versus the light box. And with all of our opt-in form A-B tests in Thrive Leads, we have a feature called automatic winner settings. And when you enable it, you can tell Thrive Leads how much data and for how long you want to collect data before it picks the winner. This is a great way to put your A-B tests on autopilot because once the winner has been determined, Thrive Leads will automatically keep showing that one and stop showing the losing variations to make sure you keep those conversion gains through time. The last opt-in form A-B test I'll mention to you that you can do with Thrive Leads is what I like to call a value proposition A-B test. And this is where you have two separate opt-in offers that you test against each other to see which one gets more conversions. If you're interested in learning more about value proposition A-B tests, I wrote a blog post about it on the Thrive Themes blog and I'll link to it in the description box below. Reason number nine. Thrive Leads gives you actionable reporting and insights. In the Thrive Leads dashboard, if you click on lead reports, it will load up all of your conversion data and then you have many different ways to display that data and what date intervals you would like to look at. With this advanced reporting, you can quickly figure out which opt-in forms are converting best, which posts and pages are doing better to convert, and with the A-B testing data, make decisions on design changes based on real data rather than just guessing. And finally, here we are at reason number 10. Thrive Leads integrates with all of your favorite email marketing tools and the list is growing all the time. So no matter what tool you like to use for your email marketing, Thrive Leads is gonna help you collect the data you need to connect with your audience. So those are the top 10 reasons why you should be using Thrive Leads to help grow your email list. If you're not a Thrive Leads customer yet, make sure to check out the link below so you can get your copy today. And if you are a Thrive member who hasn't gotten around to using Thrive Leads yet, you're welcome. So if you have any questions or thoughts about what you've seen in this video, make sure to leave them in the comment section below. And thank you very much for watching. We'll see you in the next video.